What is going on guys? Correct 1287 here I'm bringing you yet another VR gameplay video. This time I'm taking a look at Ground Runner Trials. And as you saw in that little intro, I actually played through this already once. And then I, uh, my stupid freaking Windows went and did an update and 80% of the video was filled with that Windows update message. And then my Windows actually just did an update. I'm surprised my video uh, recording uh, didn't get corrupted because it just shut off. Uh, so, normally I do try to show you guys these, you know, first playthroughs. I had some really good reactions in there, man. You guys just seen, uh, it would have been awesome for you guys to have seen the reactions to, to some of the stuff that I do in this game, because it, it is really cool. Uh, but we'll just start now at Mission 2. We'll skip the tutorial. So what this is, is I control a hovercraft, and here I'll show you guys the uh, graphics. Uh, you can also calibrate things. I believe that's for calibrating the height or the room space, so you can do seated experience. This game probably should be a seated experience. Uh, you should probably not play the standing, as I've recently discovered. I never, I don't get a motion sick, though this is definitely a game people m will get motion sick if you are prone to it. So there is a comfort mode in here. Uh, these are the default settings. I haven't changed any of them, so I'm just going to leave them the same. But, uh, yeah, I don't get motion sick playing this, but oh boy, do I get, like, just the, the shifts in gravity and stuff like that. Uh, so let's do this so you guys can see what I am doing. I think I do need to take a few steps forward. Uh, hopefully I'm still in frame. Yep, the head is right at the top of the camera shot. So, yeah, the I control this little bike. And... Oh, there we go. Alright, so now we're... See, I'm in my little seat. This is our okay, launch looks like got aggro. tunnel. Take a look, it's Ted. freaking amazing. I've got these two guns here that I squeeze the grips to pick them up and then you actually just don't even have to do your grip uh, you just kinda put your hand back there and it'll uh, reholster them pulling the trigger shoots them and here is my like throttle this controls my throttle as well as my lean so unlike a lot of VR games where you're racing you use your touchpad to control things but in this you actually have a physical like thing that you're leaning in and you can do strafing so let's just get right into it and you can kind of see my HUD up here here's like my uh, uh, menu uh, not my menu but uh, minimap the other M word and that is my objective I need to get nine enemies killed so let's grab that see I can like do that to lean but then I can push it forward and this just looks so freaking sweet and I can boost to go a little bit faster and that is incredible that feeling, guys, like it's something you're not going to be able to get uh, by watching. And you can shoot off parts of their guns and stuff. It's just so cool, like actually being able to uh, boost around in this. So I can strafe. So I can do the leaning to turn, or I can hit uh, left and right on the D pads to actually strafe. Oh, wow, I took that guy up real quick. Is he going to fall all the way down? Yeah. I want what he's got. Actually, that is not the objective. Those are just a uh, money thing. So I get money uh, by shooting those dudes down. Oh, those guys are turned fire. So here I'm not actually moving forward, but you can see I am strafing. I can just, without moving, I can just push left and right on the D-pad to strafe left and right. I think there's an E-brake of some sort, but I wasn't paying attention. It may just be, no, it can't be squeezing the grips because that's how I grab hold of the uh, throttle thingy. I can use the strafe, see I can strafe to avoid their shots and it really really helps to pick things up. Uh, looks like ramping is all done like automatically. So yeah, see I got four enemies left right now, those are my objectives to just kill these drones. But yeah, ramping in this uh, is all automatic. Kinda wish there was a manual jump button because you know, general rule of thumb in VR is you never want to do something without the player knowing it. So there, oh! Ooh. Um, but I guess, you know, you kind of know if you're going to be hitting, hitting one of those ramps. I just love these fights, just strafing around like this. It's like, it's like you're playing serious, ooh, a little bit of, a little bit of frame drop. It's kind of like you're playing serious Sam, but even faster almost. And then these ships, these ships fly over. I have yet to really see anything of them, like, attacking me or anything like that. The tracking mod inbound. All right, Watch so your and I think this is around where the game crashed on me last time. Woo, see? A ramp like that. Let's see, that looks like a... Strafe to dodge the weapons oh. fire. I just love the 360 degree like fight, like I could be driving. And now I'm shooting behind me, it's just such a cool feeling. And I can even, 
like ungrip from that, grab this, and now I can shoot and you kind of maintain your speed. Uh, oh, let's turn a bit, strafe, ooh, some weird feelings. So it's just kind of cool that you can, uh, they They're give you the two weapons. You They've gone to town this time. What? Alright, where are we looking, where are we looking, where are we looking? Where are we looking at? Oh dear. So I can kind of keep coasting, put that back. Oh no! Holster! I kept clicking to a uh, holster, but I forgot it automatically does that. weapon obviously is hit scan. Even though the visuals of it looks like there's a bit of a lag, I've discovered that it actually is hit scan. So where my laser, that blue laser, I don't know how well it comes. Oh, that ramp. Oh, that is so freaking cool. Cleared them out, kids. Which well it being done. hit scan definitely makes things easy. Oh, don't land on the bridge. Oh, okay. Went away. I think we're safe for now. Return to base. I have a new thruster to add to your bike. A new thruster to add to your bike? That's cool. It's the first time I think it's given me an award for uh, beating a level. Usually I just get the money. Alright, so let's boost our... But just, again, yeah, it's like you, you can't quite get the same feeling like, like that I'm getting. Of these strafing, just strafing across this world like this. Alright, so there's launch upgrade bike. Is it actually gonna have me enter it? Before it just has me, yeah, it just kinda cuts control and you... Ah, I kinda, I love that shuttle. Like going down that, that shuttle hallway, it just feels so cool. So at the end I got 10,000 credits. And here's my bike. And so you do get to upgrade. Upgrade your bike. I've got 20, 2,400, are you serious? I'm short by 520 points. That is lame. But you can see I've got uh, two upgrades in each one each time you do it. You know, it gets a little more costly. Sadly, there's no visual changes to the bike. It'd be cool if, you know, these disc-looking things got a little bigger. Um, but they don't, sadly. Or at least not that I can tell. Alright. Tutorial 3. Vertical Main menu. Rust. Ooh. Select level. I didn't know... Is it gonna launch me? Oh, this is... I didn't know there were more tutorials. Where's the guy? Hey, kid. There he is. I got you a new toy. Grab I just installed stick, a vertical thruster on your trigger. bike. Now we're gonna learn how to use it. Oh, so now it does let you. Oh, that is awesome. Does it use any boost? Okay, so it uses that. And can I push forward? All right, so it doesn't look like Out you can use power. the. It doesn't look like you can use the boost, but it probably just uses your Good. momentum. Or maybe he's just not letting me do it. Fly over all the waypoint pads. All right. Get to each of the pads on your radar and return all to base. Right. Oh, this is going to be awesome. There's some over there. Alright, so let's boost. Oh, oh, this is so cool. Oh, this is... Wow! 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 Holy crap! This is something else. This is just something else. Oh, wow! That just feels incredible! Holy crap, this feels so cool! Oh, oh! Holy crap, this is... Wow, this is like quickly... I'm not pulling the trigger, I don't know why I still have any boost. Oh man, the drop rate is really, really slow. Let's get to you. Alright. Dude, this is like a flying. This is not even a driving game, this is a flight game. Like, this is incredible. Like, how am I able to hold the boost this long? It's like barely even using. Ooh! This is so cool. It's like now a platformer almost. It's like a flight platformer game. Alright, let's slow it down, slow it down. Use my strafe. Use my strafe. That is just so freaking cool. Alright, I think we left some out there. Alright. Let's boost. Let's use our speed boost. Boost. Wow. Alright, let's slow it down a bit. Wow, I feel like it's using a lot more. Alright, let's strafe. Just that feels so cool. I feel like I'm actually like in a freaking futuristic spacecraft, like looking out the window. You guys ever seen uh, Aliens, which you should, you're a bad person if you haven't. Um, when they're landing the craft and whatnot. Oh, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. Three more to go. This just, ooh, ooh, bump that, bump that. Like, I just want to be like, we're in the pipes, five by five. This is so cool. Wow. This has quickly become nicely done, one of my 
Return to base. Favorite VR games, just for like the risk. Like, can I still? Oh, dude, I can't wait till this is like using all the mechanics here. All right, we're going return to base. And let's be used. You'll see I've put some hover discs yes. out again as well. Make sure to clear these out before Come on, coming in. Let's do this. You'll find yourself in situations where you need to maneuver in the air whilst engaging enemy targets. So this is good to master. Alright, did I hit that one? Yep. Alright, let's use our strafe. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Uh, sorry, that, that, that was not a noise of, like, motion sickness. Well, kind of, it's just disorientation that the change in uh, direction is just really, really quick. I wish it was a little smoother. Oh, didn't get that one all the way. Hey, right, there's one. Let's do a... Uh, This is just so cool. Shooting like, oh, that's right. I'm not crashing. I'm not hitting them. Oh, ooh, 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 ooh. All right, let's boost. Let's boost. Let's boost. Where'd my gun go? I think I holstered it. Oh, uh, come on. There we go. I got that one. All right. Did I never hit that one? Oh. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. It's just. I wish there was a reverse. There needs to be a reverse. There we go. Hit that one. Mix and matching all the different things you're doing. You gotta worry about like your height and your your speed and your your strafe and your shooting. It's just oh, let's raise it up. Oh, this feels so incredible, guys. Oh my God. All right, let's drop a bit. If they just add in a uh, way to reverse. And again, I think I saw something about an e-brake kind of thing. I might have just missed that. Uh, a reverse and a way to like make yourself drop out of the sky, maybe a little faster. Nicely done, ground runner. Return now to that base. you got your wings, kid. I need you to pick up some more auto miner salvage I took down. Mm -hmm. You're gonna need to apply your newly added thruster and flight skills. Wow. So I guess yeah. Now I don't really need to worry about that whole ramping thing being automated. Now that that is my jump. That that upward thrust. So I didn't really get too many points out of that tutorial, but I did get enough. Alright, so... Upgrade your bike! Let's put it into... I, th I guess power is like your max speed. Five! Excuse me, fifty! Not five thousand. Fifty thousand points to upgrade it now. Alright, mission rocket launcher. Main menu. Do I get a Select rocket launcher? Level. Or am I going against something armed with said rocket launcher. What is our objective here? I packed here? up a flotilla of cargo oh. tugs moving through That's this same. area. Their energy signals are all over the place, so I can't find out what sort of cargo they're carrying. They must be on their way oh. to the pyramids. If they take control of those, then we'll lose the air. Oh, shoot. I forgot if you take the grip. Take, right, take them down, ground runner. Engines. You can target the three gravity-assisted drives on the bottom of each tug. I've uploaded each tug's position to your radar. Where are they at? Oh, so those things give me power. Very cool. Alright, so they're this way. Oh, let's take to the sky. Light it up, Kent. Ah! It holstered. Dude. This feels like a like a old school. Oh Keep firing. I'm detecting heavy damage to the engine. How are we on energy? 83%. Alright, I think that one is... Oh, wow. Let's 
All right, we're gonna try, uh, let's see, I think I'm out of like rain. Oh, this is incredible. I think that one's destroyed. Is the problem? Oh, dear. What left? Okay, that one. That one. Come on, get destroyed. Is it destroyed? All right. I think I was saying, oh, wow, look at the height that I got. Alright, let's strafe a bit to the side. I don't know if there's specific points. There we go. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm going to land on top of it. Caution. Fly over the container and collect the cargo. What does it say? Fly here to pick up cargo. Oh, oh I can just land it. Alright, where's another one over here? Awesome. Oh. Come back here. I have something you can use. Great. Oh. So I found a bunch of oh, rocket control. launchers okay. and an almost endless supply of rockets. Great thing about this is that I can teleport the rockets directly into the chamber. So it just uses power from I'm your just bike. Teleport them into the enemy. But yeah, sure, yeah, yeah, why not? Don't want to think too much logic about it. That's freaking cool. That looks like a stove top. Alright, so where are they? On my m I mean, this holster is your gun. Now reach over your shoulder. Oh. Ah, perfect. We have three more tugs inbound. Same as before, kid. Let's take them down. Out of power. Out of power. Oh shoot. Oh uh, shoot, where is... Oh dang it, I need to go over a thingy. Again, I don't even have enough boost to get up to that one that was up there. Alright, so there we go. Got that. Are they homing? They're, they're not homing. They kind of are. And this is a lot more effective than... than the pistol. That was much easier, wasn't it? Yes, it was. Alright, we're still at 80%. Whoa, these are new? Looks like they sent some stingrays after you. Better move quickly. Boost and straight will help you here. Oh! Did you do that? Approach with caution. Return to 
base. Right, it's only a matter of time before they manage to get those pyramids running again. Balance. And when they do, this whole area is going to be swarming oh, with dear. hostiles. I probably could have been just using this. So think, here's the plan. I think it has unlimited ammo. I've been thinking. So and it might be good if we beat them to it. Should have just Strip been using the pyramids cargo and disable them. I need to do some tests first though. Let's get back in there. Ah, oh, are we back in it? Oh, no, it's gonna fade. Mission complete? Mission complete? Alright, holy crap, that was really freaking cool. Alright, well I don't want to spoil too much more. I don't even have enough points to get Upgrade any Upgrade your yeah, bike! Yeah, I can't. Um, but uh, Escalation... I uh, like this game Main is... Menu. This game is super freaking cool. Select like, level. If you guys don't have susceptibility to motion sickness in VR, again, there is the uh, comfort mode setting. I don't really know what it does, but it is there. I, I assume it's a vignette effect around you. Uh, so you can always use that if you are a little susceptible. But man, this is just the way you fly Main around. Menu. That was incredible. And just the, the, the juxtaposition of, of your concentration on, on the flight. And then the the gunning and like looking around yourself like you do really get a sense of you're in this cockpit again if I was sitting maybe it'd feel even cooler uh, but I like to I like to be standing and and whatnot it just feels I sit enough each day at work so um, yeah I hope you guys have enjoyed this look at um, ground runners ground runner trials ground trial runner ground ground runner trial and Windows didn't do a stupid update on me this time so there you guys have it uh, I wonder, can I look ahead and see six, seven, eight? So there's eight missions. So I spent a few hours in this uh, to get to, to mission five. So I think there's a good bit of content. Man, imagining this in PvP would be something else. I have no clue if they're planning on bringing any PvP to it. But man, I could just, whew, makes me excited for the future of uh, VR, you know, like hover, hover kind of racing games and just, whew. That is intense, the, the feeling. I, I could have been a little more talkative, but so much of my concentration was on not falling over in my room. Uh, probably could have been easier if I was sitting. I wouldn't have had to concentrate so much on not losing my balance. But these just these changes in gravity as you're flying around, strafing through the air, uh, verticality, especially when I n nudged up against stuff and I would start going like uh, the Z-axis or whatever. Um, yeah, things got things got pretty weird. Things get crazy. So a lot of my concentration was just on I'm not falling over in my room. So I uh, hope you guys have enjoyed this look at ground tri ground runner trials. Yeah, I think that's it. Have a good one. Ta ta. Cool music too. Yeah. Close game.